for Dan Brad. What's going on this Wednesday? Hey, Scott. Thank you for the introduction. Brad, how's your audio? Sounds pretty good. You're coming through loud and clear. How am I coming through? Um, also loud and clear. Uh, pleasure to be back on the Q&A circuit with you, Brad. 2020, the year of perfect vision. Love it. Um, ladies and gentlemen, we are grateful for the time that you give us in your busy schedule to take a look at our technology, our software. Uh, Trade Ideas is the leader by far in uh, idea generation. We've been doing this since 2003. Brad, we're still an overnight startup. <laughs> we're still here too. Still here. Um, the reason we, that Brad and I have not been fired is because we have done all of this with your help without any venture capital money. We totally do it by ourselves, by creating a business that's profitable and successful the old fashioned way, the way businesses are supposed to be. Without a bunch of board meetings and BS, we continue to innovate and drive the technology forward. So without further ado, let's begin by saying that our information is for, all the information you're going to see here is for educational and informational purposes only and should not be construed as any kind of uh, official investment advice. Investing does involve risk, and if you want specific investment advice as in for financial advice you should consult a registered investment advisor which we are not but we're going to talk about lots of important things that you need to see with our technology so brad you know as we keep moving forward so one of the number one let's remind everyone that of course you will be given a promotional code at the end of this webinar as scott mentioned so that you can uh, sign up for the service um, and we're going to really talk about well, why, why this is such a critical component and why it's so important to do this for your financial success and, and, and talk about our approach to it. We're also going to tell you the secret of how not to lose money in the stock market. Brad, do you know that there's a secret to it? I'm excited to find out. This is actually really good. We've got, um, this is a lot different, a different webinar than normal in that Seems to be a lot of people that aren't subscribers here, which really is nice considering the test drive is coming up on Monday. Absolutely, absolutely. So guys, I mean, we like to keep things jovial, but one of the big things that we've just added is news, and that's what this slide is about. So that you can see that for any stock that you want, we have what's called the single stock window, and I'll, I'll show you, this is gonna be the only slide I do um, from the slide point of view before I get back to it, but I'm gonna jump right into the software. So what I want to show you guys is that we are your one-stop shop for everything. You don't need other technology, okay? You, we show you the charts. If you want to, you can actually trade through trade ideas through right now interactive brokerage, but we are going to be connecting our technology to some big, bigger players like E-Trade and that offer you zero commissions. And, uh, and we're going to talk about the quick secret of how not to lose money in stocks. So before, again, before I jump into the software, let me give it to you just so that you understand where we're coming from. Okay. So ladies and gentlemen, the biggest mistake people make is they think that the stock market is a get rich quick scheme. That You can come in here, learn how to trade real quick, like the gurus on the internet talk to you about, and they've got really nice cars and they're young and they're going out to Ibiza and partying and traveling and doing all this stuff and they're trading stocks somehow. That's bullshit. Um, that's not how it works. So stock trading is like any kind of profession that you would uh, endeavor to do. You have to hone your skills. And as any professional athlete or professional anything like doctor or engineer would tell you in order to do that, you have to do what's called practice, okay? So for that point of view, Trade Ideas provides a complete simulated trading environment so that you can practice with real-time data, get real-time feedback if you're making a mistake or not, and that feedback is not going to hurt your finances. So in other words, you can pay approximately, let's say you got no discount. You could spend uh, $2,200 for a year of the most premium trade ideas with our AI and everything else and practice for one year. And you should be able to do that, spend that money, practice with real-time data and get real feedback on if you should put your real money 
to work or not. Of course, you can do it sooner, but I'm just saying that you have to keep that in mind. This is the big reason why most people lose. Most people sign up and start trading right away. Brad, yeah, and yeah. Know I mean, if, if the requirement is that you start trading right away and become profitable because you need that money, this is probably not the right place to be, you know? Right. But that's the biggest mistake, and we want you to we want to prevent you from making it. So we're going to show you how you can do that. Okay, I'm going to. So there's more to the slides, but I'm going to minimize that, and I'm going to jump right to the software. So this is Trade Ideas, and Brad. By the way, I want to make sure. Can everyone see my screen well? Yeah, it looks like it's coming through well. Nice. So one of the, one of the things that Brad and I have been working on is a kind of a bigger, higher resolution layout, so that um, you can see more information more clearly. This is one that's on a channel called Shall We Play a Game? And this is now connected to simulated trading. Okay. So this simulated trading allows me, and I, and I have traded uh, real money all my life, but it allows me to practice much like Tiger Woods practices at the range instead of always going on the golf course and playing 18 rounds. You know, when you're playing on the course, you've got to have one mindset. But when you're practicing, you're working on things. So I'm working on position management. I'm working on risk management. All professionals do this. Okay, this is how it is done. And you can do it with trade ideas without having any kind of negative impact to your financial uh Positions. You can get into a trade, and Brad, remind me, am I able to get in after hours right now or not? I, I do believe you are able to. Okay. So I, I, I could be you. wrong. I think you're, you're setting the stops, if anything. You'll put some simulation up. Right. Okay. Let's, let's show somebody. So, again, the stock market, by the way, and one of the reasons you are in the right place is look at the volatility. Okay. Um, here you have a stock that one day is at $1, and the next day jumps to like $1.8. Uh, jumps to almost $3, back to $1.71, back to almost four. You're talking about 400% swings and that immense volatility on things like $15 million, I mean, 15 million share volume, okay? Um, amazing stuff. And what you can do is you can now practice these things and see like, how how is your feel? How do you practice? Well, you can simply right click and notice you have some suggestions right here. And the one that I use is buy $2,500 and stop at the low, okay? So what's amazing about this, and let me zoom out real quick so you can see it, okay? What's amazing is this part right here, okay? Does everybody see this? So what I just did was, I now obviously you guys understand this is after market, so you're not gonna see my entry, but the stops appear so you can get a feel for it. What we have automated is the full, um, the full gamut of execution. So uh, John, the way I do it, I have my control button and I, on my mouse wheel, I can just zoom using my mouse wheel, okay? That's how I do it. Control and zoom. So you can see the stop. One of the most important things you have to do is be able to place stops on your trade so that if you make a mistake, that mistake is not life-threatening. You can take these stops and then you can move them all in practice mode so you can really get a sense and a feel of what you want to do and figure out how that impacts your trading. This, this is critical. It'd be easier or even a little bit more illustrative if you bring up X and, and bring that up because you already do have a position in it and, and what it'll allow you to do if you go ahead and go ahead and right click on your position uh, in your brokerage plus and go ahead and add a stop. It doesn't look like you have a stop there. Okay, very good. So I've been I'm practicing a building a position swing trading in X where I'm holding it a little bit longer, not just getting in and getting out, by the way. That's something else you guys must know. The whole notion of day trading is kind of skewed to scare people. You don't have to only day trade. In essence, getting out should be getting out for a reason, like risk, not just because, hey, the market's over and I'm out. Okay, so here I am. I'm in uh, 2,500 shares of X. I have an entry price of 1072, which is right here. Okay, 
Yeah, put like a 920 stop on it. All right, and I will do that. I'm gonna right click here and add a stop, and I'm gonna put the stop in at nine, about 920, uh, as Brad said. <laughs> so instantly that appears. So what that also tells you is, notice right here, it tells you if that stop is hit, this is how much I'm going to lose. Whereas right now my overall PNL um, is down, I think 4,250 from this position price. So this is right now, okay? So you can kind of understand really does your risk entail and why a little bit, do you guys see? Nobody else has this. Where as you move your stop, the loss number adjusts, okay? This is just another innovation that we bring to the table. We give you the kind of feedback that only a technology company with server side tech can do the same thing with or something. This nice about it is it allows you to see if you're really solid this type of so risk. Here I, I get, and I'm gonna, okay. Four. So here you will see once again, and I can even put it a little bit higher. So if the stock, because by the way, earnings are tomorrow. How do I know this? Notice we just communicate earnings date and you see January 30th post market. So if it has a big gap up, this is my down upside, at this target level, and this is my downside at this level. Um, this is the kind of feedback that, that is critical for a uh, astute investor or astute trader to be able to have. And you can do this all the time. Whatever it is that you're working on, let's, let's again, I, I always bring back, back Brad, um, something important that it's our position in trade ideas to give you everything that you need right away so that you are not, um, so that you don't stumble. And people always want to have like that familiarity, like AAPL. Well, what's going on with Apple? Can I misspell the symbol? So here's Apple. Um, I want to show you very important components that, that only, again, exist. This is, again, a critical component. So here I have Apple and our software says, okay, I do not invest or subscribe up or down in Apple. But if he was, this is what I would suggest they do. I would suggest you put a stop right here. If you're just, again, entering and a profit target right here, based on the behavior of this type of stock. Okay, does everybody understand? So that for every single thing that you do, there is a game plan. It doesn't matter that I'm in it or not in it. And by the way, right here is a swing exit. So if you're holding Apple, I mean, and, and again, the stock is kind of expensive, but for you to be worried about it, it really needs to get below, from at this point, it really needs to be below 285, 284. This is the kind of information that we believe simply you do not get from us is not there. And this is the advantage of trade ideas. This is what makes our technology so good, what makes us so strong as a company, as a provider of services, is that you didn't have to configure this. Let's take a look at Facebook. Again, just popular names that, uh, that you should know. So Facebook, after hours, okay, um, had earnings, January 29th post-market. And whatever happened, somebody didn't like it. And it went from two, 25 to your stop. So what the computer is saying is it's right if this thing was, uh, again, continued in this direction tomorrow. But the smart stop, in other words, if you're a swing trader, you would wanna see if it really maintained this support level. Does everybody understand that? This is the critical part, is that every single stock has a game plan for it. Let's look at uh, IBM. Okay, same thing. Notice uh, it had earnings on the 21st, and it looks like, Brad, that, I mean, uh, I'm, I'm guessing that somebody didn't like something in the earnings, or maybe it was good. Well, they like the earnings, but, you know, time has brought it all the way back. Yeah, and this is, again, volatility. This is the market, but you saw the earnings 21st, and here's a big snapback, and here is your suggested swing exit. So regardless of your time frame, this is your smart stop for today, your longer term, and your profit target. Every single stock has this. Um, 
there's no other technology company that can provide you this information the way we do it without you having to do any of the work. All of this is set up. Now notice over here on the left side of the software, okay, we have a channel bar. And this channel bar is sort of like your Netflix for the stock market where you can kind of get into ideas um, without having to worry about setting things up. We hate having people worry about, well, can I, how do you do, this is so complex. It's not that complex, okay? It's not that complex at all because all you have to do is go to, let's say, the earnings channel and click on it. And here you have it. So here, because we're getting into earnings season, here's stocks reporting earnings, okay, this morning. You can go and you can check 29, free market. So these are all, and reporting this afternoon, this is post-market, this is you know, happening right now. Wow, Brad, look at Tesla. 650. Rocket ship. Wow. Um, 29 post market up $87. Okay. So you you never had to do anything. Um, and, and you have some more information. Upside earnings blah yesterday or today, downside earnings blah yesterday or today. So you can really look at this information, and then guess what? You can filter it. So you can say change from the close dollars, what's up the most? This is obviously pre, uh, um, pre the earnings announcement. Let me see if I can. Uh... And see, I just changed it to always on, so not just during market hours. So here you have Tesla up $87. So you can see what's up the most in monetary terms, what's up the most, uh, percentage terms and make moves from there. The other thing that we do, and again, I like to just stair step basic things. Okay. So, Brad, you see this CMPR, Simpress, um, commercial printing. Number one, you can see that just visually speaking, trust your gut. Um, notice how it kind of had a bottom and then it looks like it's turning around. Okay. Turning around. Well, it so, did. I mean, look, it just had earnings and it's now at a, a dollar or $128. So it's a big gap. It'll be a big gap tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're right. You're right. You're right. I didn't. So this is another thing. Let's see. Time frame. Do we, do you, we though, show it doesn't like a lot of volume kicking through it, but we'll do see. Do we show the after hours on the daily? Or yeah, we'll see on the daily because it's happened after hours. The daily candle is not going to be built. So right, 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 right. Very, very good point, Brett. Thank you. Again, this is why we work together. So it's already had a gigantic gap up. But let me, but you know, Brad, I love that because it kind of points to what I was trying to say. A lot of times your eyes tell you good information. You can see kind of like a panic sell off and then a reversal. And I was going to say just simply that, hey, if this thing gets above like right here, um, create a price alert, which you're allowed to do and say, looks great. Now you got a little price of it right here. And obviously it's already been triggered, but I'm showing you it's the same thing. You can move it around. Very easy to do. There's no, notice how there was no programming. It's just all visual, visual. And very soon you'll be able to have all these things right at the top. We're adding all, we're taking it away from the right click menu, which is a little bit more complex for people and kind of putting it over here. So I'm gonna delete this because it's already above it. But my point is that you can set alerts for yourself and all of the things that you need are already pre-configured. Now, Peter, you were saying, how can we access the reporting this morning window? Okay, well, it's already there. Okay, it's already there. Now, uh, John, the reason you may not see the same exact fields in your window is because Brad and I are using an advanced version of trade ideas where we kind of test things out on and we give you guys a preview of what's coming. So you would have something similar, but not exactly the same. Brad, am I right? Yeah, you are. And, and what we're what we're going to be doing, folks, is we're going to be adding an option uh, to our options uh, window that's going to allow you to specify, are you working on a high-res monitor? Are you working on a low-res, like a laptop? And then you'll be able to have all these channels really specified to that type of resolution. So that's what we're doing right here, is we're working on a high-res um, channel layout. 
Right. So again, we, we just added more information, uh, John, and, and you can, like, for example, I can right click and I say, save or share to cloud. Okay, reporting this morning, save and share. And I can copy it and then I can put it into the chat, Brad, right? In theory. Um, I was typing something. What was that? I, I'm showing that um, you can share this information. I just put the link to just simple and put that link that I just pasted into chat in there and hit load and you will see pretty much this exact same window. And Peter can try it. Remember too that everything is sortable. So here you have position and range. So you can say, let me show me all the stuff that's reporting this morning, but it's close to highs. Okay. NASDAQ, you know, things that are in where I kind of would want to see them potentially. All the kind of things that you need to do, the most informed decision for yourself. This is a six month position and range. So these stocks like NASDAQ, GE, uh, TRO, NSC, they're all on six month highs. What's on yearly highs? There you go. Look. GE's really has made a big turnaround, Brad, from the lows in August. Kind of see it happening right here. Good solid move for sure. So we're just trying to showcase that you can kind of stack this information. Okay, and then look right here, news. So here you have earnings call transcript. There's still work to be to do for GE. If I click on this, notice the software looks for where the news is. And here you have, this one's coming from NASDAQ. Okay, John, uh, John, thank you very much. I mean, again, just, it's easy, guys. This is very easy to do. Um, so every stock that you see, you can look at news. And now I'm gonna show you something else that's really cool, but I really love because it allows me to work in a way that takes away kind of like your mental noise. So. Right here, I'm going to go to idea surfing. Let me switch channels real quick. Okay, so we have this channel called account builder, and um, the account builder channel. I'm is, sorry, that, <laughs> wrong one, buddy. I made a mistake. Okay, no problem. How about ready to run? Yeah, we have lots of interesting channels, but this one's called ready to run. Okay, and ready to run means that based on some ideas that we have had, these stocks are exhibiting a pattern that makes it look like it's getting ready to go. Now notice that I'm not switching any symbols, like here's my mouse, okay? Um, but watch what it's gonna do. Do you see how it's um, shifting symbols by itself? Like literally it's, changing it's it's surfing different stocks for you based on the information you see and it's highlighting what it's going to and this is called idea surfing the idea of surfing simply allows you to process more information using trade ideas than you would any other uh software because you're just exposing yourself to more uh opportunities visually you're you don't need to necessarily do anything here um but Certainly, you're now Give me a favor. Go, go back to IRTC. It was about three symbols ago. Okay. And you know this right here, you can see the um, the pressure building here on the resistance level, right at about ninety dollars. And I put a price alert there just to you know see if there's going to be some follow through through that level. Uh, which price, Brad? Like ninety? Yeah, like around ninety. And it's amazing, you know, what your eyes will spot after Absolutely. having some experience and looking at these securities. Um, and see like this window right here, this is the price alerts window. If this crosses this line, okay, it'll pop up in here. So you'll see it. And these are the various ones I have. Now I can do something else, which is really cool. Just like on social media, I can say, I like this, okay? And now, like it's sort of like the lesser form of the alert and you're it's just like an fyi and what's happening is notice we have a channel right here and i'm going to switch to it. okay 
so here are the stocks I like and you know I do these presentations to people and I show people this information and I explain how I work with the technology and at various times I've highlighted different things that have, that that has caught my attention okay and here you have it here it is oh wait okay see then this is an example right now, Brad, and I love this, okay? Really, really love this. Now, mind you, the volume here, very, very small. This is a different type of animal, okay? But nevertheless, from a pure pattern point of view, right, Brad, you see what I'm seeing, right? Yeah, it crossed the moving average, a nice 50 period moving average, and has retained that for a couple of days. Right, so what I'm gonna say is, uh, Put an alert right here at seven, and I'm going to simply say looks like a real reversal. Very simple. Okay. Now notice again, if I there's something I didn't like, I can just change it a little bit. But this now just lets me work through this information. It looks good to me. Okay, I see what's going on here. I like what's happening. Um, so the simple part of what we do is that we make it very easy to process relatively large amounts of information quickly, okay? So here you have Roku, okay? It's going to have earnings February 13th, and it's been in this kind of decline, okay? So I'm going to come over here and I'm going to say, back to positive action. So I just make a note, okay, right here. Did that mean simply it's kind of come down here? And, and now I don't have to worry about it. I can go to another channel, okay? And this is just, I'll simply highlight that we have channels that watch social media, lots of different information on our uh, technology where we're watching all sorts of different elements. And again, here you can see um, what the, what's going on with Twitter and it had a big gap down and it's kind of had a reversal there. And there was an AI buy signal on Twitter at uh, 3261. Um, now I can even read potentially, what does it say? Okay, uh, the key to winning is focus on the bigger picture. Again, see if that jives with what I'm seeing in the price action. And if it does, then potentially, you know, I can, let me go back to right here, and I can say to myself, put in a word, looks good and take a bit, okay? So hopefully, what I'm trying to show you guys is that, um, there's an easy way to work with this technology where you don't have to worry so much about, well, how did they do that? How did he get this stock or that stock? It's not about sitting there under the hood and you know trying to clean the spark plug and, and your transistor. But, but if you're a mechanic, you could, right? I oh, mean, we give the, the visibility to do any of that if you want. And that goes back to the other part of our uh, technology, which is we have an amazing curriculum set up all throughout the week where anybody can um, can sign up for our educational classes that are offered for free to subscribers who can go to any part of the software and kind of dig in. We have we have education for 101 and PhD level. You can do some actual scripting with the software if you wanted to, almost like Adobe Photoshop. You know, you can cut and paste stuff, or you can really script things. Okay. And here, of course, one of the biggest innovations that's ever been done in the stock market is our artificial intelligence stock picking system, okay? Where using statistical analysis, the software picks trades for you and allows you to follow it. You can automate this in uh, Brokerage Plus in either simulated mode or in, uh, in or for real using real money once you get comfortable doing what you need to do, okay? So 
this is the, the other component because what it really does here is it allows you to have the risk automated for you. In other words, the AI is never perfect, of course. It makes mistakes. I mean, here it's still profitable on every uh, channel, but you can see kind of how it, what it did, how many trades it did, and then there was some negativity. It just turned it around, and obviously this is a small uh, win on this channel, a very small win on this one, and kind of a decent one on this one. Um, but we've had gigantic winners, amazing days. There's no system like this on the market. I mean, let me give you guys um, one quick example of something that, I mean, this is one that I always just love to show people. Okay, so bear with me here. Okay, um, so here, remember that we get you into situations and we control the risk. So you can get in here, make a mistake, get out right here get in here, get out right here. But then here, let me blow this up real quick. But again, if you continue to follow the plan and the rules, so you lost twice, but here you're still in on the swing, you're still in on the swing, you're still in. And here it went from 21 all the way to 48, okay? And swing trading terms. This is the kind of, um, this is the kind of, Thing that we're trying to not only do consistently but repetitively and it isn't easy but i'm just showing you that it gets done okay there is no other system like this on the market this isn't uh, a guru that's just in and out in and out in and out it's a system that's consistent on a statistical basis and we continue to put a technological resources into it to help you trade it better and better and the best part is at the premium trade ideas level you can practice trade with it in simulated mode. In other words, like what I can do here is I can go to Holly, I can right click, I'm in simulated mode. 15 strategies, boom, it's on, and I can re enter. So there's like, so if you get out, but it turns back into the trade, you can still get back in, re enter longs, re enter shorts. It's just the most sophisticated, coolest tech you're going to find for any kind of self-directed investor. And I can guarantee you this because again, I'm hopefully showing it to you. This is something, this is what you, this is your cadaver in simulated mode. If you're a surgeon, you're practicing with a real body and all the exact same fluids and veins, but you're not hurting anyone. You're not hurting your account. Okay, that's the whole point you most of the people literally lose for one reason and one reason only they get into the market too quickly they lose to really take it to another level anyone on the premium level uh anyone on the premium level can come in uh and compete with other premium subscribers for free for a end of the month ten thousand dollar payout if you are the winner of the trading competition there will be rules to it of course you can't win on one trade that where a stock gets bought out like for example if you were in tesla okay and you caught this uh it wouldn't make you win because you have to have consistent behavior you have to consistently prove that you're doing the right thing it's 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 to take luck out of it but if you do it right you will be able to win cash prizes and actually learn something that you can then take back and apply to real life. It is really one of the most, um, I think, profound innovations that we're gonna bring to the table with trade ideas, where you can, in paper money, compete for actual money, but in reality, learn something that you can then apply with real money. David, which one was my analogy it was Grizzly? Uh, Brad, I couldn't remember, I have so many of them. <laughs> what did I say? Ah, well, then, no, 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 it's not grizzly. Surgeons practice on a cadaver because that's just how it's done. I mean, there's no other way to do it. Cadaver isn't going to die. And that's what we want with your trading account. We don't want you to lose money. The way you don't lose money is practice with fake money until you know comfortably that you're going to, until you emotionally and comfortably know you're going to behave the same way. That's the key, ladies and gentlemen. It's, it, that is the key, okay? If you um, 
if you start trading and start losing money, you're going to get discouraged. If you trade and realize, oh, I make mistakes here this way, or I make mistakes here that way, then you have learned something and you can apply it to your real life. Okay, that's the only way to do it. The only way. So um, let's kind of finish up here because Brad, we're already at the 40 minute mark. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring back the software presentation and go to present mode. Um, as we said, news, so you can really dial in and see what's going on. Um, testing, all of our technology, the AI, it allows you to uh, back test anything you want and there's classes on how to do it, but it's the most powerful uh, analytic software in the world really in terms of understanding how to apply statistics to trading. Um, so Peter, we're gonna have a new version up probably in the next few days that you're gonna already upgrade to. We upgrade all the time and there's gonna be a new version for the uh, open house simulated trading environment, okay? Yeah, and that'll be uh, version 131. So that's what we're testing right now. As soon as we're confident in that, we'll put it up on our website and you'll be able to download that. We're thinking right. tomorrow. Right, so this is the back testing tool. Again, I don't need to jump into it here, but you can learn how to do this. It's all available for you. Um, you have lots of different ways to view the data and trade ideas. We've shown you what that looks like in channels, but these are the component parts. Brad made a very good slide here just to show you all the different ways that you can do it. Um, now, we have a test driver. If you're not a subscriber yet, you should definitely potentially, I mean, again, in reality, the test drive is critical and we love for you to do it, but it shouldn't really matter because in your mind, you should say to yourself, well, I can invest 2,200 bucks, spend a year honing my skills to see if I can actually do it. I mean, that, that's the bottom line. I mean, that's what we want to communicate. If you want results within a month, you're in the wrong game. I mean, this is trading. Investing is not a get rich quick scheme because Ultimately, the markets have volatility and you know you can get lucky and you think you're doing good, but you're not good. Spend the time practicing. You know, if you know what you're doing, it's still good to spend time honing your skills like Tiger Woods at the range. But again, we have a test track coming up starting February 3rd through the 14th, only $8.99. And at the bottom, you can see trade-ideas.com forward slash test track. Um, this is a summary of what our software costs in terms of monthly or yearly standard or premium on a daily basis so you can compare it to like something like lunch um, and things like that i mean in terms of what we talk about so armando this is an example so multiply the, any of these numbers by 365 and that's how much the software costs for the year so this is what your daily cost is our subscription plans are monthly or annually. So you can, again, roughly speaking, multiply each number by 365 and you know how much it costs. You can divide it by 12 to see per month, et cetera. And we have discounts like today, we have a promo code for you called New Trades, 15% uh, off of your first month. So slippage, real. Um, slippage is a funny thing. Uh, number one, nowadays the spreads are very tight in general. We also have uh, zero commission environments. So you cannot really be, complete. if you're trading to beat slippage, you're not really in the right mindset to win in the stock market. You've got to win via large ROI. In other words, you've got to catch the 10 percenters, the 5 percenters, the 20 percenters, which just completely erase the slippage. You could get into a trade at $10 and sell it at 15. If you are working on slip, if slippage is a fear, that is not the right, this is not the right thing for you. I'm not saying that it's ignored, but you can see it yourself because you can see, okay, the bid price is this, the ask price is that, what am I doing? You know exactly how much it is. Plus, remember that we said that, um, on all of the software, when you set stops, you can see exactly how much you're gonna win or lose. Okay, that's the key. Um, Bill, it's awesome that you have that kind of a success rate. That's very unusual. 
Um, but if you know what you're doing there, then you're ready for the software and you can just use, again, some simulated trading to hone your skills, but you can get at it. Um, I'm not discouraging people. I just don't want people who are novices to start um, and, you know, and, and get discouraged because they haven't practiced enough. That's really what I'm saying. So the other thing that's really good for anybody who's working with us, we have a complete um, community of very astute traders led by our own Barry Anderson, who uh, is on the, our lead moderator in the trading room. And Barry is an amazing guy who uh, every day working on the trading room helps everybody, you, people exchange ideas. Um, it's a meritocracy and people give you feedback so that you know how to battle with the market and not get discouraged. Yeah. Real, the software can enter you instantly on the alert. Um, again, I don't know why you would want to wait one to five minutes. You know, it seems like somewhat of an arbitrary time frame. If you the idea is to set up the alert when the alert happens, and and again. Once you're once you're a subscriber, if you are a subscriber, we can, you will be trained on how to do it. Number one, the AI automatically enters you when an AI signal occurs, but you can set and create any strategy through any alert window as an entry signal. You just have to learn how to do that. And again, we have the education in our videos. You can see if you go to the Trade Ideas YouTube channel, there is a, a library of information and videos that helps you work through all of this information. It's all there. Education is one of our strongest parts, including going to Barry's room where other people will help you on how to do it. It's super easy to do. Just that this kind of a QA and a is more of a summary where we don't dive into it. The dive happens in the education sessions. We have a podcast of lots of different people, myself, Jamie, other uh, experts from the Trade Ideas team. So you can search on that in your uh, podcast app and tune in. You get a lot of uh, interesting ways that we break through some of the monotony and just, again, give you more insights on what we're doing. This is one of the mo more interesting times to be in the stock market. Um, we believe that 2020 is gonna be one of the best years ever. Um, we link to Thinkorswim, but it's not integrated in terms of automatic trading to it, but you can click on a symbol and trade ideas and it will load up your level two and charts and Thinkorswim and all of that kind of stuff. Remember, guys, now that Thinkorswim is getting bought out by Schwab, I mean, we've heard this from a lot of people. It doesn't seem like you're going to get a lot of love. Brad, you, I'm not the only one to say that. Yeah, it's just, a, just something that happens when companies get acquired, unfortunately. Yeah. Um, but, but Trade Ideas is your one-stop shop. You don't really need Thinkorswim when you have Trade Ideas. That's really the bottom line. Um, and you can always ask them and say, hey, we want to execute via trade ideas and see what they say. Maybe they'll uh, want to integrate. That's the best thing you can do is talk to your uh, broker and say, we want this, and then hopefully they'll listen. Um, lots of, uh, again, good information to get you started, whether you're a novice investor or just looking to hone your skills. We have free eBooks and all of this stuff that you can get on, on our website when you go to it. And if you go to our website, you'll be prompted to join the uh, the open house that we have, the test drive, and you'll get all the information. But if you go to trade-ideas.com forward slash setup, it's all right there. Um, we're very easy to get a hold of and um, active on social media. Please like us on Facebook, Instagram, and you can talk to us on uh, Twitter via at Trade Ideas, at Today Trader, and QuantBot. And of course, if you have any other questions, please shoot us an email at info at trade-ideas.com. Scott, Brett, I think. We've got everything covered unless there's- Yeah, you believe all the questions have been answered up to this point here. Great to see everybody here. And again, we really look forward to seeing you and hopefully having you join the team of some of the most successful, long-term uh, active investors in the market today. And remember, we're the only company with technology that's made in the USA by US developers. That's right, and uh, stay tuned tomorrow for an email from GoToWebinar with a link to the replay. If you missed anything, check it out. Thanks, guys. Thanks, everyone. Thank you very much. Take care.